first of all, I hope you guys had a good Christmas yesterday. I hope you spent it with your friends, your family, your loved ones, all that, man. Just hope you guys had a great day yesterday. I did plan to have some type of Christmas video up, but the problem is, is that this month has just been in shambles for me because I've been sick the entire month. Like, bro, I haven't been sick for like this elongated amount of time in in just so long and it's it, it's such a pain in the ass bro like my schedule has been totally mixed up my productivity has been strange so thank you guys so much for bearing with me and whatnot but regardless today demon slayer you know what we're here to do last episode what the hell even happened oh yeah like zenitsu and daki were beef and heavy uh we got more inside nadaki obviously she loves moves on i mean who the fuck does not and it's like uh, she to me she doesn't have any redeeming qualities right now like obviously we haven't seen her backstory i don't even know if she's like really about this fucking life like she literally just wants to kill people she literally doesn't care about anybody except like muzan bruh she literally just wants to kill people and stuff like that i already know her simp army is growing bruh i'm seeing the crunchyroll comments i'm seeing the twitter comments every time someone posts a picture of her so her army is growing stronger by the day but i will remain strong right now when saying Daki has no redeeming qualities bruh but obviously i'm still excited to see what she has to bring to the table um this arc has been honestly kind of just comedic for the most part i mean last episode was pretty like half and half it was kind of like comedic but like really serious at the same time so i feel like Last episode kind of set the tone shift. Like, I feel like stuff is going to get a little bit more serious as we go on. But, I mean, honestly, I, I'm loving the comedy, bro. Like, the comedy in this arc has been hidden. I'm, I just got to keep it real. But yeah, everybody, that's about it. We're about to see what's going to go on. So, yeah, like always, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. You already know the deal, though. But without further ado, let's get it. What we got, dude? Very Young Children. Is that the title of the... <laughs> Those are the title of the books, Young Lady, Very Young Children. Okay. Couldn't get any more specific than that, I guess. Dude, this music, man. I feel like I'm in Kung Fu Panda out here. Bro, this dude, Tanjiro, is still just chilling here, having a great ass time. Well, it's Initsu and Inosuke are fine for their fucking life out here. Tanjiro, you better get your ass on the move, bro. Where the fuck is Tangin 2? Episode 4 tonight. Okay. So that's the name of the episode. They, they didn't show the name of the episode in the preview uh, last time, so. Oh, right. Zenitsu got kidnapped by Daki at the end of the last episode. I forgot about that cliffhanger. Damn, bro. Chill out, dude. Man, it's stressed. Now, Daki's coming for your ass cheeks, bro. Oh, okay. So, they're actually meeting up right now. That's cool. Tanjiro, man. You smelt it, bro. You smelt the stank. You gotta believe uh, Inosuke. Come on, G. What the fuck? Okay. So, this man, Tango Uzi, was just chilling here, huh? That man using his Hashira powers to good use. Okay. So, Tangan already knows that he got captured, huh? Okay. We're seeing a little bit of, uh, I guess, seriousness coming from, from Tangan. First time so far. He seems pretty serious about things right now. Damn, he really pulling this card. He's like, yo, okay. I'm sorry for involving you guys. I got to do this shit by myself. And of course he teleports. Oh shit, we ranked up. Let's go. Hey, okay. So we're what? Are we right? We're right below canal. Okay. What the hell? Yo, Tyler don't even know about that shit, bro. Hey, that, that bro was depressed, dude. Fucking Rengoku died and everything. I man had no time to think about that. We seem to be taking this very lightly. This feels strange. Zenitsu got captured by an upper rank demon, guys. We've seen what the upper rank demons can do. Akaza, he literally could have fucking killed us all if it wasn't for Rengoku trying to slow him down until the sun rises. And now we're like, oh no, an upper rank demon has Zenitsu. And like they're they're just like they're just fucking around. They're literally just slapping each other and they're like, okay, I mean, like they're just they're literally just doing some 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 tomfoolery, some silly shenanigans right now. Um I feel like we should be a little bit more serious about this, guys. But I mean, do you think? I mean, uh, you're the demon slayers here, not me. We're still alive because oh, plot armor, cool. bruh. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, don't die on us, Inosuke. Bro, they need to animate Inosuke with his boar mask off more. I'm telling you, his design is so fire. I'm telling you, dude. I just, I want to see his face right like the rest of Demon Slayer, dude. Oh, that's wholesome. And now, time for sadness. Damn, Tanjiro really showed up like it was nothing. Oh, okay, the disguise is off. Let's go, okay? I'm here, I'm here for it. I'm here, okay? Like, we're strapped now. I'm a man. I was about to say, bro. I'm like, come on, bro. Bro, everybody, the disguises were ass. Tengen literally set you guys up. Okay, what the hell is that supposed to mean? You're gonna die? Oh, okay, she's, she's getting married. See, dude, they're foreshadowing this happy stuff, man. And it's like, something is going to happen to you. I already know. You're, Daki's going to kill you or something, bro. Damn. This is a cool interaction. I like this a lot. The colors, once again, man, everything looks just so aesthetically pleasing. Like, it just looks so pleasant to look at. See, bro, look at this bullshit, man. See, dude, you can't, 
you can't finesse me bro look at this bullshit fabric right here docky man like you had this whole wholesome thing like oh i wish you all the happiness um oiron of this house and it's like yeah you know someone wants to marry me i couldn't believe it so happy so wholesome so funny too you know i already knew you were a boy fabric's coming through fuck off docky come on man oh lord see dude like come the fuck on bruh docky is becoming more and more unlikable bro like i honestly liked i liked koinatsu way more than docky just from that interaction with uh tanjiro right there oh my god cgi tanjiro oh he, he smells the stank that docky stank damn dude that's actually sad as fuck i don't know for some reason that was like such a, that was like a really meaningful conversation between Koinatsu and, and Tanjiro right there. I really enjoyed that a lot. And Daki had to go fuck it up. And Nosuke, why? What the hell is going on, bruh? God damn, these mice are diesel as hell. These are Tengen subordinates. They have like Tengen's like little like headband thing. Oh, it's time. Oh, he put the boar mask back on. I think, okay, yeah, this is like the little uh, scene we saw in the uh, the trailer. Hey, right, we back, we back. Okay, I missed the boar mask a little bit. He got, he got his swords again. That man Tangin is here. God damn, that man threatening people. Okay. I'm about to say, dude, I don't think that man Tangin playing. I'm about to say, bro, like if there's anybody that has a, the highest chance to get back at Daki, it's probably Tangin right now, man. So I guess, is, is that what his sound breathing is? He's just like super quiet or he can like negate any type of sound he makes? Or I guess that's just one of his abilities, maybe? Everything looks cool by the way like i feel like the budget kind of went up a little bit right now for the series shit damn we're all really about to like converge right now see dude where's is she alive this man tanjiro is looking furious right now shit i'm furious too i'm not even gonna front okay she's still alive okay that's nice he sees the upper six yep all right let's see what we got okay tanjiro come on man shut the fuck up bitch god damn okay I mean, Tanjiro, we can dodge, you know? We just took that shit. That man is stunned. He's like, God damn. Fuck, I guess dodge is out the way. We better get that defense up then. She really one-shot stun locked us. What the hell? I mean, yeah, dude, you literally flew through a goddamn building, man. Your body's gonna be like, what the fuck just happened? Wait, she absorbs people with the fabric, like on some Majin Buu type shit? Okay, Doki, stop looking so cool because like, I don't, I don't like you, man. Oh, the straps broke. Wait. Why is that the first time it's happened? All right, Nezuko, you can, uh, you, can, you can come help us. You know that. Okay, never mind. Don't leave the box. You're about to get clapped up, I guess. Oh, this is like in the trailer. Hey, okay, we're actually fighting. Oh, wow. I mean, to be fair, we're actually like holding our own, I guess, like defensively against the upper moon. Like we cut her fabric. Whoa, that's so weird, dude. She's like in the fabric. Like, like, like that's some like Paper Mario type beat. We're actually leveling up out here. That's actually really cool to see. Uh, I don't know if you can do it solo, but honestly, if you guys jump her, you guys can probably beat her. She definitely doesn't seem as strong as Akaza, so. Of course, you got to leave us on a cliffhanger, though. Like, really? Of course, you got to do that. Damn, dude, that started getting really, really good, man. Fuck. Ah, oh, that started getting really good at the end. Next episode's going to slap, I already know. Okay. Tanjiro versus Daki, just like that, huh? That's gonna be really interesting. Inosuke and uh, Tengen are like kind of converging on our position, or at least they, you know, they're they're aware of that Daki's on the move, and you know they're they're trying to do their own thing. Zenitsu though, he's uh, I don't I don't know where he is. He, I don't know if he's in the fabric or he's somewhere else right now. That was a really cool episode though. The first half was a little strange though. It felt like kind of out of place, um, in my opinion, like the mood, like. Everything got like super serious, right? But like, I still can't help that Tanjiro and Inosuke were literally just like, they were like, just like fucking around on a roof for like five minutes while Zenitsu was captured by an upper moon. And then suddenly like everything's just serious and like Tengen's threatening people and, and, and Tanjiro and Inosuke are like, okay, let's just drop the, let's just drop the disguises. Let's, let's get into this thing. Yeah, honestly, just really good episode. All right, let's just see this preview though. Or are you gonna leave us on an ending scene? You're telling me Tengen has this army of strong ass mice. They're just fucking stuff up behind the scenes. Episode five, things are gonna get really flashy. Oh, wow, okay. So Tengen is gonna get into the mix, huh? I mean, the episode has flashy in it, so he has to, you know? But yeah, guys, that's gonna be it, man. Uh, like I said, really, really solid episode. Really good episode. I really, I really like this a lot. Uh, that last half, or I guess like I should say the second half, um, was really good. That was really good. I really liked the conversations with Tanjiro and um Kuenatsu. i thought i don't know for some reason it was like really endearing it felt like really it just felt really personal man like it, like it felt like real you know it felt like really an authentic conversation that they were having and i already know Daki was gonna fuck some stuff up and uh yeah uh so tanjiro right now 
he's gonna try to 1v1 Daki. And Daki literally like hit him one time. And, and Tanjiro was like, holy shit, dude. Like he was like, he was like, he was stun locked, literally, dude. Man got hit with that paralysis real quick. Um, but yeah, la uh, next episode says uh, things are gonna get flashy. So I assume that Tengen is gonna come through and help us out a little bit. I honestly don't feel that. I mean, just from Daki, I mean, I, I, it's not like Daki is fighting at full power, I don't think, or anything like that. But from right now, uh, you know, Tanjiro was kind of holding his own against Daki. You know, he separated uh, Koinatsu from like her fabric. And, you know, even Daki was like, yo, your midair moves are like, actually like pretty good. And I don't think Daki's as strong as Akaza. So, yeah, I honestly think like if all of us jump her, we actually can beat her. So, yeah. But other than that, everybody, uh, I'm really excited to see this next episode. Make sure to leave in the comments down below. Let me know what you guys thought of today's episode. Also, make sure to leave a like, subscribe as well. It really helps support a lot, guys. And, uh, yeah, man. Um, I don't know if Daki's going to redeem herself. I don't know if she's going to go through some type of redemption, man. But so far, she just she's just an asshole. Like, I got to say, she, she's kind of just a bitch to everybody. I mean, she probably will, though. I mean, like, that's kind of like the theme with Demon Slayers. Like, the demons, like, when they're dying, they're like... They kind of go through like this revelation type deal that's kind of been like the pattern so i assume it's gonna you know it's gonna be like the same deal you know or not i i could just be wrong as well but i guess we'll see so yeah everybody uh it's been your boy ever guys hope you have a great ass day today and i'm out peace